the basic idea here was to create a simple cup holder that would attach to my loft bed. Um, being that a loft bed is high off the ground, it's really quite annoying to reach down and have to pick things up off the floor. So I wanted to have a water bottle holder that could just be easily accessible. So um, the first drawing I did didn't work out, so I just threw that out. So I started a second one. This one turns out a lot better and I kind of liked how the design was going. One thing you'll notice here with that turns out different from the final is the curve on the top. I decided when modeling it that it was just unnecessary complication. It didn't really save any filament and due to me wanting to use command strips rather than screws, I ended up just removing that whole top piece altogether because the command strips were only slightly taller than the cup holder itself. So this is my final design here that I decided to go with all my dimensions laid out. So, and then here's me just simply coming up with the command strip idea. I had it after I had the screws, but I decided this was far less permanent and way easier to install than a bunch of screws. So I decided to go with that. So I brought everything into Fusion 360. I just started simply modeling for my dimensions, starting with the main water bottle holder itself, followed by the back piece. I made everything right around three to five millimeters thick because I find with PTG plastic that tends to be more than strong enough for most applications, especially with this sort of thing that's not really gonna be holding too much weight. And so I simply just made this little bottom piece here along the bottom to hold everything up. After extruding everything, uh, everything started turning out pretty well. I got a pretty good sense of the shape. I could have stopped everything at this point here, but everything else from here on is basically just saving filament and it's minor editing to make it more efficient, easier to print, more aesthetically pleasing, less sharp, that sort of thing. So I started putting these circles and rectangles all over the all over. This just allowed me to save uh, filament just because it would just cut out massive sections of areas that just weren't really needed. My water bottle's not too heavy so it didn't really matter too much. And then here's just me filleting all the edges to make it much smoother to hold and easier to work with so I didn't cut myself while trying to use the water bottle holder at all. And then I simply brought it into Kira for my final uh, slicing. I decided to go with PETG plastic for this, I just find it it's a lot stronger for this sort of application so I decided to go with that. Um, it's Overture PETG plastic in white uh, at 230 degrees celsius for the head and 90 degrees celsius for the bed. I was going to print with supports but I decided not to as I just found them slightly unnecessary. Even if the circles don't turn out too well it's still a waste of filament just to have that and that was the point of the circles in the first place. So. I just decided not to use support. If it turns out ugly, oh well, it's just a water, just a cup holder. When I brought it onto the printer, everything started out pretty nicely. I haven't had any major problems with the final print. The first layer looked a little bit ugly when I was watching, but as the print went up, it just pretty much went with no major little mistakes. One thing you will notice here though, especially in this shot, you can definitely see that there are sort of little bubbles and stuff with some of the filament messing around and not turning out completely smooth as I was hoping. But it's not too bad, it's just a cup holder so it doesn't really matter too much. Here you can see on the inside just all the little bubbles and everything, which were pretty to clean up just by scratching them off with my fingernail. I decided to use two command strips to make sure that it was more than strong enough because I've, I've, I've had problems with hooks and stuff not being able to hold up sweaters. The water bottle might not be as heavy as a full sweater, I just wanted to make sure that it didn't fall down in the middle of the night and make a ton of noise. These are just basic command strips, nothing too fancy. turned out pretty well in the end and it holds tons of weight and it perfectly fits my water bottle. 